Godzilla King of the Monsters blasts into theaters in May 2019 with a rogues gallery of god-sized titans. We break down Godzilla, Mothra, Rodan, and the Monsterverse. You're nobody till somebody gives you a cinematic universe. So if Godzilla wants to be king of these titans, he better bring the thunder for his sequel. You gotta be kidding. Godzilla King of the Monsters is a sequel to the 2014 standalone and the third film in the MonsterVerse after 2017's Kong Skull Island. And as you might have guessed, Kong and Old Laser Breath are due for a showdown in 2020. Which of these titans are here to protect us and which of these titans are here to threaten us? Good question. Godzilla may get a bum rap, but over the 32 features made by Japanese production company Toho, as well as three Hollywood films, he's often protected humans against other titans and mutos, or massive unidentified terrestrial organisms. Aw, they're kind of cute. Now, some of these mutos have been identified as beloved titans of the classic Toho era, such as Rodan, an enormous pteranodon dinosaur that erupts from his slumber in a volcano with a trail of lava on his tail. King Ghidorah, a three-headed dragon that is typically Godzilla's public enemy number one. They're everywhere. Battling for dominance. And Mothra, the winged insectoid kaiju that shoots blinding god rays from her wings. After battling in 1964's Mothra vs. Godzilla, the goddess of Infant Island got Godzilla and Rodan to team up with her to fight Ghidorah, the three-headed monster. No spoilers, but we think that plot might inspire this new one. With better effects, of course. Tiny fairy twins, or Shobijin, usually accompany Mothra and sing this beautiful tune to summon her. Millie Bobby Brown's role may be a revamped version of the Shobijin, and her mystical connection with Kaiju was foreshadowed when she was seen reaching for the larval form of Mothra in the first trailer. And look at that smile! She and Godzilla must be pals. Now this first showdown will also introduce new titans to the franchise, like this moving mountain thing that looks like an easter egg reference to the anime Godzilla Earth. One thing worth noting, Nobody's called the infamous giant ape by his full title, King Kong. So this Kong may be a different Kong, or he may have to take the crown from Godzilla in 2020. More standalone films for Mothra, Rodan, and other titans may be in the pipeline, but we're waiting for Godzilla's goofball kid Manila to enter the ring. Spooks, spooks.